All right. Cars fixed at Sobo. This should be interesting. It's, it feels a little loose. I am slow, and the bottom split is going to be ugly, so hopefully that gets done and we can look at those results because, man, it looked like a mess. So, um, currently having a weird issue here. There we go. I think I solved it. We are going to have custom numbers for this race as well. And I'm the number five. So we are going to get the five car paint scheme. Just get all these set up real quick. But, uh, yeah, we got 15 cars here. And we'll probably be the 15th fastest. Uh, it's just... It's awkwardly kind of loose. I gotta remember to fix my... Can't drive short tracks with 10 to 1. It's awkwardly loose at points, which is probably not loose, it's just fast, but um, it gets really tight when I run the line that I want to run, so I've kind of been running a little higher. We're going to have to hope that there's a bit of tire burn on the right rear by people, and eventually they get slower off the corner. we're doing, but it's just that little bit of a right rear slide out of the corners, man, this guy's internet is trash, so we're not near them. But, yeah, it's always an interesting race here. Very narrow, and when bad things happen, they usually happen to everyone. So we a little bit of pace here. Currently 11th quickest. This line wasn't working very well in practice, but it's actually turning down there. And we say 11th fastest. That's not a good sign. We're not too far out. So, that's our paint scheme. We're going to be the 5X today. How far off were we? Okay. Uh, you know, only almost half a second. That's good. Let's go qualify. It's just so that we can start in the back, I guess. on the straightaway. Off to a great start. We're driving turn one. Can we at least get to an O? Nope, because we're going to hit the wall. Well, we did get to an O at least, but we may have invalidated both laps since it was close on the straightaway. To the finish line. We get a 991. Right, and it doesn't count. No, it does count. Alright. But it's not going to be fast enough to matter. Yep. Not fast enough to matter. Alright, who was the blinking car? Maybe they got their. No. No. Was it the 14? I guess we'll find out. Look at what's going on and qualifying. So we got the one car sitting here. Not going. Not even in his car. Got Sonny in here. Second time we have 
ran with him. Six car now, so he is up in fourth place. And that is his car today. Got the 11, 12 out here, doing some laps. Down their second, or no, they're just doing laps. And the one car. Okay, so apparently this is how you go fast, is... cheese it up like this. Uh, people that do this stuff, it's just, it's hilarious. Like, already faster than everyone, but they've gotta go that extra little inch. It's something with the left front tire, I was told, where if you heat it up or, like, slide it a bunch, it will make you faster somehow. I don't know. Like, when I hear stuff like that, I'm like, hey, cool, I, I don't care. What good's it going to do me? So, yay, he gets pull that he was already going to get. All right, so we're starting 10th. And, well, that's kind of just a bad, bad place to be. Back of the pack on the outside. You're on the outside this time. Closed. Pit road is closed. Could be instantly in the wreck. The estimated strength of field is 3,762. We expect to be fighting for the podium. I think the blinking car, Five though, is behind us. Grid. I hope. But again, it was blinking so much I couldn't even tell what car number it was. Still waiting on two cars to grid. So it's the five car. Uh, eighth place is perfectly fine. So, I've just got to try to stay alive. Not use the tires up. Waiting on the final car to grid. We got a 60 lap race here. Just try to be smooth and smart and not wreck myself like I just did in an IndyCar race. So I gotta go re-record one of those, cause wrecked myself out early being stupid. Yeah, safety rating wise, the row ahead of us, 10 and then the car on our inside a little bit lower down in the twos One to go. Uh, the bees on. aren't too scary because normally if you're going to be bad at a bee you're going to be down in a two even though that 3.4 is the same as a 2.4a but looks like it should be okay and Get someone ready. has Don't crashed worry. At the back, it looked like they just hit the inside wall. Let's go racing. Totally missed that start. Inside's getting checked up. Let's get to the outside of the seven, though, on the exit, because that's a good way of getting slammed into the wall, and... There's that South Boston wreck. All 
take a Phantom Zero X to a Four X. Yeah, shit, that wreck's still gonna be over here. And it is. Uh, we're in fifth. Well, I know what my screenshot's gonna be. And now I don't even have to try, I can just save and hope these guys really burn their shit up. Some of the wreck people can probably track us down, but we're just gonna let this guy go. He's already got a bunch of damage. We'll see if they burn him up. That was the big one. There is no reason we made it through that. <laughs> that was pure luck. After starting the week off by driving straight into the wreck at Charlotte. Um, that was so lucky. see if anyone behind us made it through that like we did. I thought I was going to get hooked when I was trying to turn down from the cars on the wall. I thought for sure. Then that 0x was so late in registering, I thought we got through it with even without even prediction code contact, but again, not even going to worry about a when we survive it. Car behind is not for position. We're only 13 laps into this thing, so... This is going to be a long one, and very possible that these guys burn their stuff up, but also very possible I burn my stuff up. Now we're all kind of going the same speed, which is meaning that they're either saving or I'm going too hard. Seventh place car is catching us slightly, but not too much to worry about. That was impressive, though. That was a track blocker. But we'll get the lap car past us, and then just see where everything falls. by himself, it looks like. I mean, it is possible that some of the people that wrecked could come out and pass us if we're that slow. But I'm not sure anyone is in a position to do that. They are not.
one car is leading, and I think most of his competition got wrecked in that, so... He's got nothing to worry about. We have something to worry about, though, with the 13 catching us. sort of reward at the end of this run for being slow. Not the A car was getting ma massive loose off the corner, but I haven't seen that from him, so... Not since he got ahead of us, so it might have just been me making things up, looking in the mirror. Almost to halfway. Let's see if we can start tracking down the nine. Doesn't look like it though. I'm guessing they started ahead of us, so they were faster than us to begin with. No one's really going down low to the apron, so I maybe need to just get that out of my system. Slam and throttle off corner out of my system. I wasn't doing that. Now I am. Now that we're in sliding. Alright, the lap cars have passed the 13 behind us and he lost a second in that. I'm starting to lose grip off the corner. Now what we gave up getting passed by the 8. The nine's going to have to lose that amount of time. We're going to get a little bit closer. But he smartly just moves up and gets down. Patient. 
me burn up this stuff. Looks like they're fighting for a position as well up in third and fourth. That could slow them down. entry and then sliding up and getting no drive off the corner. by doing absolutely nothing but getting lucky. Do not know how we got through that. All right, there's check and flag. Good job, very good job. That was 
was something. What were my tires? 7380, so we were not doing good things to the right front. Alright, so what happens? What starts this? Kind of looked like there was two wrecks at the same time. So, the two decides to just turn down and hook the eight and wreck him. So, congrats to the two on that. At the same time, the three decides to turn down across the ten on exit. And, yeah. Then, they all die. But let's just watch this real time to see how close I was. Just a clip. We're so lucky, though, because right here, we're going to be in it. There's nowhere for us to go. And then the two car sucks down the sixes front end, and they just turn left instantly out of my way. And then I just turn down and miss that, even though we get an X. How much bigger did it get back here? Well... They're all trying to slow down. Sonny goes over. The two car flipped upside down, but that's deserved for him causing the whole thing. And that is the wreck. Let's watch it from the TV cam. seen bigger in real life like they they've had a bigger wreck in that same location last year but this place is just it gets so clustered but when you have someone on lap three right hooking another car off the corner never gonna be good well, I don't think anything happens after that there might be a little bit of contact but not going to be anything. Nothing worth watching, I'm sure. So, yeah. Alright. Well, let's take a look at results. Gain 29i rating. Safety rating stays at a 499. Bottom split is done. And not as bad as I thought it would be. I mean, there was only one person on the lead lap at the end. And this person got disqualified for some reason. But, <laughs> uh, really looking at our incidents, everyone got an incident except for the one. But that's because he was out front. So, that was a weird one. Hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for watching.